Time is now 923 and it is time now for our favorite segment of the week. You know what that is. The pet of the week segment and joining us today is Shelly Lamb and also Tammy Cranack from Parent Hope Rescue in Manaway. Thank you ladies for being here. Okay, we have this little guy. Tell us about Petey. Petey is a white fronted Amazon parrot. <laughs> He's about 10 years old. Mm -hmm. And as far as the Amazon parrot goes. He's mm -hmm. the smallest of the species. Okay. So he's a real special little guy. He's a little bit shy, but he's every bit in Amazon. Um, excitable and strong-willed. Um, he likes to kind of hang out on a shoulder or a forearm. He's not a real snuggly bird. Okay. Um, but he does like to be included in the activities of the family. So mm -hmm. So don't try to like hug him and do all of that. Don't try to hug him. He <laughs> won't like that. No, no. So what type of family will be good for Petey? Um, I think Petey would be good with a family who wants um, just to have a companion animal mm -hmm. involved in their daily activities. So as I said, he'll hang out on the shoulder or mm -hmm. hang out on an arm. He likes to watch movies with the family, play games with the family. If somebody works from home, he's a great little guy to kind of sit on the computer and, and just kind of enjoy your companionship. And, and what should people know about if they've never owned uh, or had a, a parrot as a companion? What, what should people know? Before? Well, there's a lot to know. So we do offer classes at our rescue and it's all free. It's open to anybody that wants to learn more about birds, but how to feed them, how to care for them, what to expect, um, how to bathe them and, you know, how to really enjoy them. So you offer the classes then? We offer classes. Speaking of feeding, we gave <laughs> little Petey, so you guys have to check this out. So look, Petey likes craisins like me. Oh, what there he goes. Look at him. <laughs> How cute is he? <laughs> so if someone is interested, in, and he keeps dropping them, so <sighs> Petey, you're just like my kids. <laughs> Here you go. One more time. Oh, there you go, Petey. So if someone's interested, how much would he be? I guess he, you know, he doesn't. <laughs> how much would, would Petey be? Uh, Petey's adoption fee is six fifty. Okay, okay. Very good, very good. And you guys have an event coming up more on the classes, I'm told? We have October 20th. We'll have a uh, parent care class that day from 12 to 1. And you can go to our, our Facebook to see more information on that too. Okay, so there we are. Is this is this Petey on the screen too? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so that's Petey a little more active and thank he you. He does his cockadoodle do. Oh he does. <laughs> I hear if he has a, a cell phone, he, he would do the cockadoodle do. Does anybody have a can hurry up? Okay, let's see if we can get it get it here. Okay. Really quickly. Petey, look at the cell phone. <laughs> He's looking at the picture. <laughs> I think Petey's Stage a little nervous. <laughs> He's a little nervous. Oh, thank you oh, so much to you ladies you. for thank being you. here. Thank you. We will have all the information if you're interested in adopting Petey or any of the other birds with them on WKYC.com. And of course, we also have some great news when it comes to Pet of the Week. We love our success stories here at 3 News. And We've got an exciting update for you. Now, do you remember Blue? So Blue is there in the middle. He was featured on our Pet of the Week segment two weeks ago, and I'm so happy to announce you are looking at Blue and his new forever family. Yes, he's found a new home as well as a new name. They renamed him Marshall. So special thanks to the family who adopted Marshall and are giving him a lovely new home. Kaitor.